Hi everyone, this is Dave from Geekanoids and this is the Kanex Me Drive. This is a file server for the iPad or Mac, but do stay tuned if you've got a Windows-based computer. It does in fact work with Windows-based computers as well. So let's take a look around the packaging. Just on the side here, it says here, the Kanex Me Drive is a USB file server that turns a USB storage into a network drive. So any USB storage like a flash drive or even an external USB the hard drive will work with this. And then you can connect your iPad or other iOS devices or your Mac or your Windows based computer to this Mi Drive and then you can stream uh, movies, music, uh, you can even transfer files across and it just works really well. It does also work with Android based devices as well. We've got WebDAV SMB support, Apple Bonjour auto discovery service, 10 100 Ethernet USB 2 mini USB power port and it's USB bus powered as well. It gets a one year warranty with this and I will put a link to the Kanex website in the video description. So let's have a look inside the box. Now normally you do have to unseal it. There's a couple of little plastic bits that you have to uh, uh, cut with a knife but I've had this out already and very nicely presented. Uh, this is the Mi Drive itself, which would just pop to one side. I'll show you what else you get inside the packaging as well. We have got a little user guide. It's going to guide you through getting up and running with the device. And then we've also got a little package here with a couple of cables in. And everything's in miniature form. Believe me, it is in miniature form. So we have got the USB cable for powering the device. So you do have to connect this either to a computer or a wall socket and uh, this is the cable we're going to use for that. And then we've also got a little mini Ethernet cable as well, which so you're going to plug this into your router or into your home network so that you can then access whatever you plug into the Mi Drive. And then we've got the Mi Drive itself. Before I give you a guide around this little box of tricks, uh, it's very difficult sometimes when things are on camera to see how small products are so I'm just going to pull in my iPhone 5 and you can see this is a really small device it's probably about double the thickness of the iPhone 5 but the actual dimensions along the other dimensions are actually smaller so let's have a look around the Mi Drive so on this side here we have got a little tiny reset switch we've got the power connection here via USB and then we've also got the Ethernet socket this side's completely clear this side we've got an LED indicator light on this side here, this is where you're going to plug your drive. The bottom is just pretty clear. And then on the top, we've just got the Kanex logo. Now I mentioned about media drives. Now in here, you will plug a USB flash drive. So you've got maybe movies or files on a 64 gigabyte or 32 gigabyte flash drive. You can plug it in here and then it becomes accessible over your uh, sort of network through the Kanex Mi Drive. Or you can plug in an external hard drive and access the files on that and stream them to your iPhone or your iPad or even gain access to files on your uh, Mac laptop or Windows desktop, whichever way you want to use it really. It's a very flexible solution. Now during my testing, I found that this has been most useful for just plugging in a USB drive with some movie files on and then being able to access those on my iPad. It works extremely well indeed. It's a nice compact unit. It's very well built and just a, a pleasure to use really. Very well thought out device and extremely useful. This is the Kanex Me Drive, a little mini sort of file server with an app available to make things move along at a nice pace. It's a really good little product and something I definitely would uh, possibly consider purchasing for myself if I wanted to really stream content easily to my devices. So thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, please do give it a thumbs up and I will see you all in the next one.